Hey everybody and welcome back to Totally Thomas. So once again, we have a pregnancy update. Y'all, we getting down to the wire. This is pregnancy update for 31 and 32 weeks. Is it 31, 32? Yes, yes, it's 31, 32. So let's just jump right into it. Okay, so first and foremost, peeing out of this world, y'all, like, peeing crazy because y'all remember i had that cough and it was still going on in week 31 so like if i cough too hard i peed a little bit sneezing peed a little bit laugh too much laugh too hard sneak i mean peeing a little bit like come on now like we got to get this together like seriously because i told y'all she sits so low that like I'm guessing when I was sneezing, coughing, laughing, she was pushing down on my bladder. I mean, I'm not like full blown just peeing on myself, you know what I mean? But if you've ever been pregnant, y'all know what I'm talking about with that little like, and it just be like, oh crap, I just peed on myself a little bit. I actually uh, started walking more in week 31, but it's not because like I wanna walk. It's not like I'm trying to be productive or anything. It's just because Jace, enjoys walking to the bus stop instead of me driving him to the bus stop i mean i guess that's a good thing i just sometimes i can just be so lazy and i really don't be feeling like walking but jay's be like mom yeah, are we walking to the bus stop today and so i just be like okay yeah we can walk today or whatever so thanks jace <laughs> i already told y'all i was still coughing still coughing of course it wasn't as bad as um it was prior but it was still there it was still a cough people still noticed it it wasn't like i was dying anymore but um yeah it was still like pretty pretty bad y'all in week 31 i experienced my first like my first um what do you call it my first experience oh i had my first experience with swollen feet like they weren't bad it wasn't really bad like swollen feet like not to the point because i've seen some swollen feet now like it wasn't to the point where i couldn't put on my shoes or do nothing like that and it didn't last very long i think it was only like one night and my little toes was looking like little piglets and whatnot it was really weird because like i told y'all i've never experienced that before so i was just, like looking at them like all crazy because i'm like okay i told y'all my hips was like sore or whatever um so to combat combat so to combat that i started stretching a little bit in week 31 like i'm doing like little hip stretches or whatever um uh, not not a lot like i y'all i'm very inactive it sounds so bad but i'm not an active person so i wasn't stretching like a whole bunch but I did start stretching and that helped a little bit like my hips are not as tender anymore like some days they'll be a little more tender than others and some days it'll be like non-existent but I feel like me starting to do my little hip stretches or whatever has helped with that and you guys this might be a little bit TMI however your girl is pregnant pregnancy is TMI by itself right so, with that being said, I'm gonna just go ahead and tell y'all, I had got a hemorrhoid in, reg in, in register. I had got a hemorrhoid in week 31. And when I tell you, it was like nothing nice. Now, I've never had hemorrhoids before. I've always heard about them, but I thought you only get those when like, you're constipated. No, baby. No, 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 no. You can get them just for being pregnant no other reason just because you're pregnant your ass got a hemorrhoid literally but the good thing is it went away in like two days now now i'm gonna tell y'all what i feel like helped me a little bit but don't judge me so I was reading up on it and I was reading up all the remedies and stuff and how to get rid of them or whatever. Sometimes they say they last until um, 
your pregnancy is over and I was like no 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 I can't do that this is not this is not what's up so what I did was I iced it I grabbed me a cube of ice and some a uh, 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 a towel and I sat on the toilet and I iced that motherfucker okay for those of y'all who have to deal with hemorrhoids throughout y'all pregnancy or throughout y'all third trimester or for however long until y'all have the baby oh lord I am praying for you my heart is with you because that's just that's just not a thing for me oh lord just thinking about it is just hurting my whole soul so we just gonna get off that and move into week 32. the cough was still there in week 32 that i was telling y'all about like a couple weeks ago still there getting better but still hadn't gone away yet which i was starting to get worried about because that cough was lasting for like a long time so I was starting to get worried but I talked to the doctor nothing to worry about so yeah so I had a doctor's appointment and in at that doctor's appointment I really don't remember too many too much of the details but I do remember that I was 118 pounds and my blood pressure had went up some more so blood pressure is good uh, weight is good and baby was good Heart rate still the same, 154. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it for that appointment. But in the same week, I also had my ultrasound appointment because I told y'all that um, my OB wanted me to get one because the baby was measuring a little bit small. So I did go and get that ultrasound and the baby was head down, you guys. She ready. She's she ready. Um, and... Yeah, that's like really exciting because it's like, oh my gosh, she's almost here. Ugh. So I was kind of sad because she didn't, the lady didn't give me any pictures of the baby. But <clears throat> what I saw was super, super cute. That's why I'm kind of sad that she didn't give me no pictures. But let me just tell y'all. So one, my child has an attitude problem. Her lips was like all poked out. Like, why is y'all messing with me? Why is y'all touching me? I'm not here for it, like full blown attitude phase, okay? I got to see her profile, of course. <laughs> so cute. Um, I also, what else? She was yawning. She was. And I don't think she's a thumb sucker. I didn't see her sucking suck her thumb. And but her hands was all up in her, but her hands was all up in her face though, so. She didn't want us to see her. She was just, I think she was just mad because we was messing with her. <clears throat> but yeah, so the um the ultrasound tech told me that the baby was weighing in at three pounds six ounces and that she was pretty much measuring 29 weeks, and that's kind of small considering I was 32 weeks. But the ultrasound tech told me that like their measurements can be ranged from um anywhere from one to two weeks so i shouldn't worry about it and that she probably not even really measuring small because that's just the normal range it, it should measure within two weeks either forwards or backwards so the, being that i was 32 weeks oh wait no she dumb anyway yeah i actually think that's it for this update. I just need to show y'all my belly and then we're done. All right, y'all, I had to go grab a t-shirt because this is a romper. But anyways, here is baby from the front. Left. And the right. So there you have it guys that is the update for weeks 31 and 32 i will be back for weeks 33 and 34 and yeah thank you all so 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 much for watching we will see you all in the next one bye